Hey guys, Negative Gagaby, and uh, today I'm watching the trailer for Security Five Nights at Freddy's: The Security Breach. Now I'm a fan of this. I'm hoping it gives me some ideas for my book that I'm writing for the FNAF fan world. But hmm, this comes out really good. As from what I've been told from my family and friends, this game's gonna be one heck of a goal setter for the next Five Nights at Freddy's that come out after it. Because I've played them all except for the VR and AR yet. One, my AR can't run on my phone and two, I don't have virtual reality headset yet. But hey, might have soon. Let's jump in. Gregory, your friends are worried about you. I'm Gregory. They're here with me. Oh! Please, come Who's on. Who's that funny? Gregory, I oh. may have lost my temper but it was That's just a glitch. Uh, it won't happen that again. Is that Is that Twisted Blora? It's been such a difficult day for all of us. Yeah. Why don't you come out and we can play a game together? Spice Freddy? It won't happen again. When did Freddy get buff? It was just a glitch. Glitch? Gregory, be still. I think she's found us. Oh, really? Really a jump scare at the end of it? Really? God, I hate jump scares, but yet, yeah, that's what makes me love the Five Nights at Freddy game so much. I played them because they have jump scares and they get your heart racing. Makes you know you're alive. But hey, let's look back at it quickly. One, who the hell is that? That looks like Twisted Blore a little bit, but too much bone. Is that some like dead skeleton dressed up in clothes? The glitch trap is controlling. Maybe. I don't know. That's too much of a theory. <laughs> a game theory? Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. <laughs> Moving on. When did Freddy get so buff? Literally, when did he get buff? That's kind of weird if you ask me. Also, quick heads up, sorry if my audio sounds a bit scratchy and if you can hear me breathing. I'm still sorting out the mic, it's a bit touchy, touchy touchy where the slightest sound it will pick it up. Because I haven't got sound dead or said sound dead in, a, in my room yet. So when I get that it might help a little bit. Alright, where else was it? Um, Vanny, the bunny that's jump scared us right here. Um, as far as I know, Glitchtrap, the character you encounter in Five Nights at Freddy's VR, when you find all the tapes, you've released him, he's awake, he's alive, he's coming to get you. If you follow him, he traps you in the game and he takes control of your body. That's a theory. If he traps you in the game, you die. Die in the real, you die in the game, you die in real life. Spy Kids 3, die in the game, die in real life. Reference. What if it's not just Vanny we gotta worry about? Because as far as this part says, I think she's found us. That's Freddy. Gregory, be still. And apparently we play as a kid named Gregory. Now I'm hoping this game is one of them free roam games. And hopefully it doesn't turn out like freaking FNAF World, because not even I'm going to play that. I've completed it, I'm not playing it again. Too much of a mess around, having to jump from one place to another place to another place to another place to another place. Just to get all the parts or pieces that you need, like keys and clocks. 
more coins just to buy the upgrades so you can win battles. Or find the chests. Or find Fredbear wherever he hides, which is kind of annoying. But yeah, better not turn out like a FNAF world because that was sad. Even I, who plays Five Nights at Freddy games a lot, say that one was sad. Freak. <laughs> Even um, Pizzeria Simulator, that one was good. Kind of scratchy, but it was good. The jump scares in that made my heart race. Freaking, um, this the location. How you got to move around. If he, if Scott Cawthon can pull that mechanic into this game, he might turn it into something decent. Really decent. But yeah, that was the trailer for FNAF Security. Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach 2020. The next game in the series. No, I haven't read all the books to the series yet. I'm still trying to get them. Really hard getting them in where I'm living. Currently. eBay. eBay. I don't have a proper work about on how to use eBay yet. Still learning. Because I'm... Still beginner. Um, EB Games, if any of you have heard of that. Um, when I have her, I ask about Five Nights Freddy things. Some of them look dumbstruck like they've never heard of it. Like it was never popular. Frick, the game made top in the indie games and I think it was 2012? 2014, I can't remember. But no, it made top of horror indie games at one year. And I'm like, walking down at school, I was back in year six, I was walking along at school, saw some kids on the computers and saw this oddly weird looking game. They let me try it, I'm like, nah, the jump scared done it, Bonnie scared the living hell out of me, I'm like, yep, yeah. I had nightmares for a following few weeks, Bonnie's gonna get me, Bonnie's gonna get me. Next year, when I hit year seven. I got told what it was. I was at a completely different school, but I got told what it was. A game called Five Nights at Freddy's. That clicked a spark in me. I'm like, oh, Freddy's? Five Nights at Freddy's? Hmm. Started looking through. Games started popping up everywhere. Game after game after game after game after game. I started getting obsessed with it. I started loving it. I'd play as many games as possible from the ones that people know to the ones people shouldn't play because it's kind of weird and creepy at the same time and to ones that just boggle your mind as to why they exist but yeah that's the security breach trailer PlayStation 4. It comes out on PlayStation 4. Yes! I'll get my PlayStation 4 this week. This week. And not only PlayStation 4, once I figure out how to record the games that I play on PlayStation, I'll just play my PlayStation 4 record games, figure out how to record my voice while playing the games and recording them, post them up on YouTube, edit the YouTube thing so it has a thumbnail or something like that proper title and uh yeah once i figure that out i'll be able to do my five nights of freddy's security breach once i get it the um hello neighbor game which i got not too long ago and the uh, menu and ink machine which i actually got today and today is friday 25th of september to the, the day that I promised my PlayStation would arrive, but didn't also do some Terraria, some Spyro Reignited. I finally got that. Decent game. Not too long ago, me and my dad were playing it. We completed the first game. It was so easy to complete till the last level. Took me 50 tries 
to get the pattern correct on how to take the shortcuts and all the speed ups and slow down parts on the run and once I figured it out I luckily snipped it just by one snip hit and I won then I had to find out I had to go back and do it all again I'm like no not happening not happening so yeah once I figure it out I'll be doing a lot of games even doing GTA 5 on there play that with my friends any of my friends or family that watch this remember leave a like down below leave something like a message below for me to read because I have to reset up my Facebook because the old ones gone too far gone to fix but yeah this was negative Caleb signing off hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you all next time